Okay, so I just wanted to quickly mention that I'm now going to be having scheduled times to upload. I'm going to be uploading on a Sunday and a Wednesday at 6pm. If you want, you can turn on your post notifications on by clicking the bell next to the subscribe button and you'll be notified when I upload and I'll be there waiting as it comes out to answer comments. So yeah, back to the video. <laughs> YouTube channel or if you're new here hi my name is Jess and today I'm going to be doing a long and awaited video for you all I'm going to be doing a Q&A and I asked you guys maybe two weeks ago for some questions and I actually got a lot more than I expected so thank you to anyone who commented I'm going to try to answer as many as possible because I did get quite a lot actually so let's just get started Okay, so the first question is from Libby Ellis and she says, what piercings do you have slash want to get? So first of all, I just have my first and seconds done and then I also have my belly button pierced. And in the future, I think I'd just like to get a couple more ear piercings and for right now, I'm pretty sure that's it. Okay, so the next question is, are you popular in school? Okay, so this is quite a tricky one to explain. I feel like every school sort of has like a group that like everybody knows maybe not for the best reasons um and me and my friendship group are not part of that so i wouldn't say that we're popular but everyone knows who we are i really love my friendship group i've got so many really nice friends and there's probably like eight of us in my friendship group okay so the next question is what made you start your youtube channel and i started my youtube channel first of all in February 2019 I'm pretty sure and I wanted to start it for like a while but I just like I didn't know whether I wanted to because I have had like many other YouTube channels like a few years ago where I've just only posted like a video or not gotten around to posting a video but I've always really really wanted to and I really felt like I wanted to get into a hobby that I could really enjoy doing and put a lot of time and effort into it and honestly I do not regret it one bit this has been like one of the best decisions I've ever ever made like honestly seeing all of your comments actually makes me so so happy so I'm really glad that I decided that I decided to make a YouTube channel okay so the next question is are you a Christian I am NOT a Christian I was actually never christened okay so the next question is where do you shop the most I would probably say pretty little thing and Primark are like the two places where I like to get my things from but for clothes these days I mainly just buy from pretty little thing because my jumper right now is from pretty little thing and so are my joggers I always just love the clothes there and I can spend as much time as I want picking them out and we have next day delivery for a year which is always a bonus the next question is have you got a boyfriend no I do not okay so the next Next question is what has been your favorite video yet to film hmm I feel like my favorite video that I've probably filmed there's two that come to my head first and the first one is my back to school stationery haul and the second one is my what's in my bag video I really loved filming the back to school videos and those were my videos that probably did the most well and yeah they were just really fun to film because i have a bit of an addiction to stationery what is your favorite day of school okay so i'm pretty sure this question is like meaning as far as my timetable so i've just brought up my timetable app on my phone okay so i'm pretty sure this question means like in terms of timetable and my favorite day is probably a friday i've just brought up my timetable on my phone on my school's like app and i have biology first and then English and then history and then maths and then I have drama last on a Friday which I literally love especially if we have a good lesson so the next question is what is your favorite part of making videos that is a really good question um I love filming sit down videos like this where I can just sit down and talk to you all so filming is definitely probably my favorite part but then i don't know if you can count this but i also absolutely love replying to comments it gives me this really happy feeling inside and it just makes all the effort that i put in worth it and i like editing but iMovie can be a bit stressful sometimes so that can be quite annoying and that's why some of my videos get delayed so the next question is from isabella 
M and it says what do you want to be when you're older so from literally so so young I've always wanted to be an actress I did used to want to be a singer but I'm pretty sure I just want to be an actor now um that is like my absolute dream if I ever do something to do with that I'll be absolutely so happy and the next one is have you worn braces so I have mentioned this in a few videos but I have got like this brace retainer thing on my top teeth but I always take it out for filming and I have struggled like wearing it and like remembering to put it in but I'm actually getting my top braces on in a month so if you want me to film it like if you want me to film the process comment that down below and I'll probably do that if I get like enough comments to do it the next question is what is your favorite movie my favorite movie is bridesmaids honestly if I'm ever sad just turn on bridesmaids i literally almost cry every time watching it because it's so funny like honestly if you haven't seen bridesmaids i would definitely watch that but i also love mean girls such a classic what's your favorite subject so my favorite subject is a drama because i just i like acting i love drama what is your favorite book favorite books are actually by an author called Shari Lapina Lapina her books are really really good and I either love the one called The Couple Next Door or A Stranger in the House those two are really good books the next question is do you get paid for your videos no I do not the next one is from Jess Grace and it says what GCSE options did you take and I know that this can be different in other schools but I chose history over geography and then we have like two other options so i picked drama and art and if you want me to make a video on gcse options i have actually got requests to do that so if you want me to do that comment that down below i always write down your comments of things you would like to see on my notes on my phone so if you do ever have any requests just comment them down below do you prefer making videos or editing them making them how long does a video take to edit or upload this is a good question so the upload only takes about 15 minutes um it's really not that long to upload it used to take a couple hours but like our wi-fi improved so now it's like really really quick editing though it can take me from about an hour and a half to sometimes like three or four hours like it does actually take me a really long time and if I have a technical issue it can take me days like I spent seven hours editing the hairstyle video if you want to go and check that one out so yeah it can take a really long time what is your favorite makeup brand so hmm my favorite makeup brand is probably Anastasia 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 Beverly Hills um I have like their modern renaissance palette and like a couple of other things and I really like their products what is your favorite Netflix show okay so I have a couple so I absolutely love Pretty Little Liars it's like oh my god I was so so sad when it ended it's literally oh I rewatch it all of the time like it never gets old for me I love Pretty Little Liars but then I also love the Vampire Diaries like Delena all the way <laughs> and then I also love um, Good Girls that is a really good one that's a Netflix's own series so yeah that's good how many lessons do you have at school so we actually have five one hour lessons in a day what are your favorite skincare products I'll show you okay so one of my favorite face masks I've ever used is this clear skin one by tropics i think it is and it's just a green mask and it's really oh my god it's really good to clear your skin and then my favorite moisturizer is this one that my friend jesse recommended to me and it's this vitamin e moisturizer and it's the intense moisture cream because i know there's like a couple of different ones and i've almost used this up like i use it all of the time like every single day and i've also got the night cream one but i honestly just love this one so much and i'm pretty sure it's only like two pounds or something like that and then i also love garnier micellar water it never does me wrong i have like a couple of bottles of these and i've used so much of it i just use it to take off my makeup and it's just really basic but really really good so the next question is what do you use on your hair to wash it I actually use Tresemme shampoo and conditioner. I'm pretty sure it's the Salon Silk one because I know there's like different Tresemme ones. Um, but it does make my hair like really shiny and soft and silky, which I really love. So I use Tresemme. 
What is your favourite bubble bath? My favourite bubble bath are the imperial leather ones and I know I've mentioned these in my what I got for my birthday video. I love the marshmallow one and the foamy banana one and there's like a couple of others that I really like. Best holiday you've been on and why? So my favourite holiday I've been on is probably to Australia. We went there for my dad's birthday and we went to like four or four or five different places and it was honestly so so cool to see like their culture and it was just really warm really nice and i'd never been anywhere like that before so it was really really cool and interesting and i'll never forget that experience we went for three and a half weeks and i'm so lucky to be able to go to somewhere like that so the next question is from Emily Fox and she has a few questions for me here. What is your favourite food? Okay, so one food that I really love is like a roast chicken dinner, like the roast chicken, the Yorkshire puddings, the roast potatoes. Oh my gosh, I absolutely love a roast dinner. I'm sorry, but chocolate is like everyone's favourite food, so probably chocolate. Where would you like to go on holiday if money was no object? So I would go to America and I would probably tour around America if like, you know, I could go anywhere. And I would go to California, New York, I would go to Florida, I would go to a bunch of different places in America because it is my dream destination. I want to live somewhere in America when I'm older. That's like my ultimate, ultimate dream. Like, honestly, I've always wanted to my whole life, literally probably about 10 years, I'm 15. Have you any pets? So yeah, I'm not sure if you've heard her barking in the background, but I have a dog, a black Labrador, and she's called Ellie. She has been in a couple of my videos, like in the vlogs, I feel like, just in the background. What are you most scared of? So two things first pop into my head for this one. The first one is death and the second one is sick. I have this like really horrible feeling of sickness ever since I was like really little. Like I feel like maybe one or two occasions triggered it when I was younger. But like I do get really, really scared of sick. Like when I've eaten a lot of food, I get really nervous that I'm gonna be sick. I get really nervous when other people are sick. Um, yeah so sick <laughs> if you were stuck on a desert island what three things would you take wow this is a really good question so i would probably just take my three best friends and we would have a really fun time there <laughs> okay so the next question is do you dye your hair or is it natural and i have been asked this by a few people mainly at school so many people seem to think I dye my hair like every single month, but I honestly don't. The last time I dyed my hair was in June 2018 and I just got it from like here, like lightened and now it's like really grown out and I've had bits of it cut off. And I'm actually considering like when I leave high school going like darker, like I'm genuinely considering it. So tell me what you think about that. I just feel like I want to go darker. Like I keep thinking about it and I can't get it out of my head, but I'm not gonna do it in school time. I will probably wait till I go to college. What job do you want to do when you're older? I would love to do anything in like the acting industry. So the next question is, what are the top three things you want to achieve when you turn 15? And I have actually just turned 15. So I'm gonna think about what three things I want to achieve. I would love to achieve 5,000 subscribers. It sounds like a lot, but like that is my goal for like by the time I'm 16, I would love to have 5,000 subscribers. That honestly blows my mind, but like that is one of my goals for being 15. I would also love to, as like a goal, it's not really something to achieve, it's like a goal that I want to stick to. So obviously like um, I am gonna be going into my GCSE year next year and I'm gonna be taking GCSE. So I want to like work really hard on them and like do my very, very best. But I also want to make sure that like, especially this year when it's not actually my GCSE year that I'm doing other fun things and not just like using my whole weekends to like revise and things like that. I just wanna like get out and do like lots of fun things this year. And probably my third thing that I would love to achieve is probably coming first place at a cheer competition with my cheerleading squad that would be really really amazing because i love cheer somebody else asked what options am i doing for gcses and they said how are you finding it so i don't regret two of my options i don't regret doing drama and 
history over geography however i do sort of regret taking art again if you want me to do a video explaining this um i would for sure do that i know i have had a couple of comments asking that which video were you most surprised about the views slash feedback on okay so i was probably most surprised for the first day back to school get ready with me because i never ever thought that i would have a video that got that many views if i just check how many it's on now 15,250 views that is insane like 466 likes i was absolutely not expecting that out of that video because it was just it was just the first day back vlog like that's just what i thought it was so i was really shocked at that and then i was also really shocked at my cast video i titled it i got my cast off after six weeks and this was when i was like really really small like i maybe had like 20 subscribers and it got almost 2000 views which was like i was shook at that because i was not expecting that okay and the final question is do you have any social media so i've been meaning to say this for like a few times in my video but i actually made an instagram account like a month or two like maybe two months ago um but it's actually called jessica abby xo i'll leave a screenshot on the screen here and you can go follow that that is me and i'm gonna be posting like when i'm gonna be uploading and like things on my instagram story and it's gonna be really fun so if you want to get like extra info about my videos and when i'm filming and what i'm getting up to um it is just jessica abby xo on instagram and i would love for you to go and follow that that would be really cool okay guys so that is the end of this video i absolutely loved answering all of your guys' questions and i was really shocked at the amount i got so if you asked me a question then thank you so so much i'm pretty sure i replied to every single one but if i didn't i'm really sorry i'm thinking about doing some more q a's in the future so if you'd like to see that smash it a big thumbs up subscribe down below we've just hit a thousand and we're on the road to two thousand subscribers i would honestly be amazing to reach 2000 subscribers before new year so let's see if we can do that i love you all so so much and i'll see you guys next time bye Mwah.